What's up guys, it's Ugly Shoe here, and welcome, welcome back to my, uh, to my Let's Play of Memento Mori. Uh, I'm on map 5, I don't remember the fucking name of this map, because I took a little break. Oh, the Waste Tunnels. Oh wait, no, that's not the real name of it. Yeah, it's called Waste Tunnels. No, it's not called Waste Tunnels, it's called Sentinels. I don't fucking remember. Uh, anyway, um, so I'm with Jeremy again, and this is a couple days later, and, uh, you know what, we're just gonna get started on this. Um, fun fact that I actually realized about my source port is, um, for some reason, my, uh, my source port likes to count lost souls as percentage of kills in the map. So when a, can you stop? Because, so, so when a pain elemental, turn that off! So when a pain elemental spawns a lost soul, it actually adds the percentage and I have to kill the lost souls in order to get 100% kills. Now, okay, yeah, so what you want to do here is kind of take your time, kill all the hitscan enemies. Don't run forward yet, because you will die. Because there's a revenant there. Alright, so once everybody's dead over there, I'm just going to run right across and kill this. Now, this part is very time-consuming. You pretty much have, like, I think there's, like, six sergeants in each of these. Ow. And there's actually no way to get in there, so that was convenient. So your best bet is to just wait for them to walk by and just shoot them as they walk across. Which, like I said, could be very time consuming. I think that's all. Alright, that was like world record time for killing those guys. So you'll start, and then you'll run in here. There's chain gunners over there. Be careful of those chain gunners, they're really not too much of a threat. But, um, but yeah, just, you could really just shoot across this, ow, 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 kill them, ow, 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 you know, we're just gonna go ahead and get our first secret now. Yeah, there's four secrets, and I like to wait until everything is dead to go, to go, what the, where the hell did you come from? To go collect them, but, we're just gonna go get it now. So yeah, at the very start, you'll wanna jump down. Hit this pillar and then come on here and then wait. This will lower. There'll be a blur artifact and, and an invulnerability. Now, to be honest, you don't really need the invulnerability for anything in this map. This map is really, really easy. Um, but it just kind of makes everything a little more, uh, a little more fun. So now you can just go up in here, awaken everything, and not give a fuck. None of the enemies in this ow. None of these, none of the enemies in this map actually pose a threat. What the fuck is this caca demon doing all the way down there? Oh my god! You know, how come when I do a test run, everything seems to go very smoothly, but the minute I start recording, everything goes wrong? Whatever. I think those chain gunners died. Guess we'll find out. Oh, forgot about him. Yep. If there's a cage in this map, there's a rip. This map is actually very short, and hopefully, hopefully I'll be able to finish it in time. Alright, yeah, so. Um, kind of ignore that Mega Sphere and only take it when you need it. I'm kind of in rough shape, so I might take it early. Um, but anyway, grab the shielding suit, hit that switch. This will lower a first pain elemental I think our first one but yeah so in this source port in order for me to get 100% kills I need to kill the lost souls very annoying but anyway uh, yeah so now that we have the shielding suit jump down grab the red key jump all come all the way down here and we're gonna go get our second secret I'm gonna run all the way down here take this lift up the teleporter be ready to shoot oh wow I actually teleport the helmet there's two hell knights in here one just conveniently happened to be there and the other one is in here and uh, you can grab your blue key. Run back to the teleport and then brings it right back over here. So now you have your red key. Uh, you know what? I'll just take the next one. Open that and just. We're gonna get to killing everything in this level. I don't understand why they give you so many power ups in this map. And the monster count isn't very high at all. The map really isn't very challenging. That was my mistake. Standard shotgun has a little more range, so we'll take this out. I 
think everything is dead. Actually, what we'll do first is we're going to jump down here, lower this lift, hit that switch, this will open up, revealing a berserk pack. But that's not the secret. Lower this wall, that's a teleporter. Come in here, grab the computer map. Oh, 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 fuck. Hold on. Really can't pause right now, Jer. Right, yeah, you'll probably take some damage, but just kill that cacodemon. That's an exhaust? Yeah. See? Wow, what the fuck? Anyway, uh, yeah, kill that cacodemon, grab the computer map, and just fall down and just run back over here. Because um, we didn't actually do what we needed to do in here. Here's a switch back there, you'll want to hit that. This will lower, reveal some more cacodemian nuts. And uh, I think that's about it for this room. If you want, you could kind of... I fell. I don't feel like taking any more damage. That's not a secret in there, but there's like some shotgun ammo and stuff. If you want to just straight run in there. Or just take the teleport and go from there. Uh, now, next thing you want... This part could be tricky. Uh, remember where we killed that Hell Knight? Instead of going left to go to the red key. Go right. Fall down here. And now run all the way down. Just run down here. Awaken everything. And just kill everything that right your path. Get some shells. And now take this part however you want. What I like to do is just take the standard shotgun out. Or maybe even the shotgun. Really off reference. Ooh, forgot about that shielding suit. Yeah, it'd be good to grab that too if you could. How did that fucking kill me? Or hurt me anyway. All right, lower this, and then be. Oh, actually, if you want to run over here, there's some plasma. You could use that. Um, yeah, so there's just a lot of room. Ooh, chain gunner. And just pretty much kill everything that kind of gets in your way. Or even if it doesn't get in your way, if it just looks at you funny, kill it. Now, it's actually possible to exit this map without the blue key, but we have the blue key, we have that luxury, so we're going to go ahead and answer it. Oh, I suck so much. Oh. And there's just some health potions and fun stuff in it. So we're almost actually done with the map. It's going to be... Oh! oh Cacodemon! There's actually one more secret. You come over here at the very end. There's like this little thing with a hole in it. Hit it. There's some, uh, some items in here. Alright, so... Now that I think everything is dead, we have all four secrets. We're going to just come into here. Oh! You're looking at me already. Like I said, with that mega sphere, it makes everything really, really easy. And that's uh, 103 out of 103 for me. I think there's only really like 98 or 99 monsters in the map. Um, but that is everything. Now, there's the exit right here, and in order to open it, just take a teleporter. Driver 1, and that switch will pop up. Just hit that switch. That'll lower. And that was Hell... Oh, Hell's Kitchen. That's right. Uh, that was map 5. Um, by Orin Flaherty. Um, this map is really boring, really easy, uh, nothing special, um, but I mean, you get some nice power-ups, it's fun to play, it's a nice little break from map 4, which was total shit. Um, thank you, Jeremy, for not being too obnoxious today. No. Except for the, uh, but the it porn. Eight years to beat this well, yeah, that's true, it took me 8 minutes of 47, which is still a little more than it should have, but I was taking my time showing you guys what to do, and, uh, so that's about it for map 5. Move on to map six, the power station by Mark Clem. And I actually don't remember too much about this map, so this next game should be interesting. Um, so that's about it for this video, and I will see you guys next time. Take care. Peace.